So sometimes there is uh, some confusion between uh, the word cancer, the word tumor, the word lesion, the word mass, and uh, the reality is that uh, these terms are all used interchangeable. Keeping it in very simple terms are abnormal cells that your body produces from different organs that can spread to different parts of your body. Cells normally divide in a very controlled manner. There are a lot of different checkpoints in place that the body has. Cancer cells um, kind of evade those normal checkpoints for, for one reason or another. And that's what cancer is. So it's uncontrolled cell growth of the wrong cells. In terms of cancers, we kind of broadly divide them into two different types, solid cancers and liquid cancers. So if you think about solid cancers, those are the more common because they can arise from any of the organs in the body. But the liquid cancers are the ones that arise from the, within the blood. The analogy I always give folks is that cancer is a spectrum of disease, and it's very important to understand where in that spectrum you are uh, before you can move forward really with a good discussion in terms of how to best manage the condition. Most of the time, cancer is just really bad luck. And it's no one's fault, it's not anything you did, it just happens. Sometimes the patients have options. It's our job to explain to them what the options are. The three types of treatments that we use for cancer are surgery, radiation, and chemotherapy. That depends on the type of cancer you have, how far it's spread, and then what we're capable of doing as far as a surgical intervention in relation to size. So chemotherapy is systemic therapy, or what we call it goes through the whole body. It doesn't matter if uh, that cancer was in the pancreas or in the liver or in the stomach, that drug will go everywhere. And uh, therefore, if there is any, even one single cell that escaped that uh, physical treatment, it will be killed by the chemotherapy. Now, surgery, on the other hand, typically is just going to treat that primary mass, tumor, whatever you want to call it. Radiation is x-rays that we use to give patients to treat their cancer. It's given from outside of the body uh, by special machines. Uh, use radiation to either kill the cancer or to make sure the cells that uh, are potentially still around are killed before they can start replicating and forming other cancers. You know, we're talking a different language that you may never heard before. You're obviously overwhelmed. The fact that they support you so much wasn't so bad. I wouldn't trust anyone else with my life.